Hi, my name is Whitney Wilson, and I wanted to start my presentation with a question. Have you ever walked into a store and picked up an item, whether it be an article of clothing, an object, or a treat, and it instantly made you think about someone? Isn't it crazy that humans create such a personal connection to such simple and tangible items, and how we can relate one to another even though they really don't have anything to do with each other? For this project, we were asked to pick out a box that meant a lot to us that contains five objects that explain ourselves and our personalities. When I was thinking about the objects I wanted to be in my box, I tried to find things that would relate to my past, present, and my future. So starting with my box, I chose this box that I just used at my wedding this past June, and we used this to hold all of the advice cards from our guests at our wedding. So definitely people in my past, as well as people in my present. So it's kind of a representation of both. Which brings me to my first item. The first item of my box is my engagement ring box with the googly eyes on it. This is super important to me because it shows how strong and amazing my husband is and how our relationship is a huge part of my life, as well as this will carry on from past, present, and future. The next item of my box is my point shoes. So I danced for the last 20 years, and although I'm not dancing anymore, I am teaching dance and I've been teaching for the last seven years. I've been teaching at six different studios around the Salt Lake Valley, which is super awesome, as well as the fact that I get to help them create and keep going with their dance journeys as well. The next item in my box is my travel journal. This is definitely a representation of my past, but as well as hopefully my future and where I can go next. So this is super important to me because it's a big part of my life in the sense of hobbies. I had a goal to visit every national park, and although I'm not there yet, I'm getting close. So this is definitely a big part of my life and who I am. The next item in my box are these two baby football helmets. One's for BYU and one is for the Jets. These are super important to me because they are genuinely my family's entire life. It's what we spend most of the time doing, Thursday through Sunday. Two of my brothers played for BYU, and one of my brothers actually is on the Jets, which is super awesome. And my youngest brother, who's playing currently at Corner Canyon, will be going to BYU in a couple years. So definitely a huge part of our life. We spend most of the time watching football, and that's where we bond. So that's more than just my past, but currently my present and definitely going to be a part of my future. And the final object in my box is my weekly planner. I use this for everything. I use this for what workouts I'm doing, what I'm eating throughout the week, what outfits I'm going to be wearing, what time to get up, what time to go to bed. Um, every single little part of my life and every detail is written out in here, which helps me contain my OCD. So definitely a huge part of my life. These five objects were more than just random things I found around my house to explain myself or kind of things that I liked. They're definitely huge staples in my life and of my personality. And when I was thinking about these staples in my life, I wanted to see if when people thought about me, they thought about these items. And typically, I hope that they do. So I challenge you to sit down and to really take time to think about the objects and the things in your life that make people think about you. Are they things that you enjoy or are they things that you wish people didn't think of? Thank you so much for listening to me speak and I hope you guys have a wonderful night.